everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Shelby and this video is a part of my juice cleanse video series. So I'm about to embark on a seven day juice cleanse. If you guys didn't see the first video of this series, then I urge you to go back now and watch that video because these videos build upon each other and they build you through the progress of not only my juice cleanse but of the effects that you will feel on your juice cleanse and they're here to better educate you so that you can continue going and know why you were doing a juice cleanse. So today's topic is what to do before a juice cleanse. Although I'm about to start my juice cleanse today, it's really important the couple weeks or week leading up to your cleanse to do certain things, get rid of certain things in your diet just to help the process and the detoxing period that you will feel and we will talk about that later in this series of the effects of that. But some of the things you're going to want to do first and foremost is to get rid of any processed foods. All of those foods are taxing on your body and when you start to wean yourself off of them, your body is able to detox itself naturally so that you don't have to feel all those effects those first couple days of your juice cleanse. So you're going to want to detox yourself off processed foods, alcohol, caffeine, that includes teas, um, mix it in with like herbal teas instead, and you are also going to want to get more rest and you are going to want to start drinking more water just to ease your body into understanding the feeling of being hydrated and the feeling of being relieved of stress so that it can actually heal itself and work in its natural way of detoxing and healing your body. And the other thing that a lot of people don't do this but it is going to exponentially enhance your effects of the juice cleanse and make you feel amazing is if you start a week before to add more, not mushed up foods, but more blended food options. So more smoothies, more um, cold raw soup. Sorry, Nemo wanted to join us. So you're gonna wanna start, hello, I love you too. You're going to wanna start adding in a lot more non-solid food. So if you guys wanna see what I did, I actually made a video and I will link it in the description box below so that you guys can see what I did. I am trying to transition into a more raw vegan diet because the summertime here in Florida is super hot. So I added in some smoothies. You'll see I added in a, a raw soup, which was amazing. It's delicious, hydrating, mineral dense. And then I still added mostly raw foods at night and some cooked foods. But a lot of it is super clean, everything is a whole food, all of it was organic and local. You don't have to go so hardcore into it like I did, but like I said, it is going to enhance your effects and make you feel a lot better and it's going to shorten that heavy detoxing process that you're going to feel during your juice cleanse. So get rid of the crap in your house, add in more whole foods, get rid of the coffee and the caffeine, and it is going to make your experience so much better and is going to make the effects of a juice cleanse in which you bathe your body in the minerals and vitamins and nutrients that it needs. It's going to make it so much more potent in your system because the juice can just go in there immediately and you've already detoxed a lot of stuff out so it can just go in there and start to heal your body and give you energy and allow your body to feel better and get rid of all those taxing stressors that we put into our bodies every single day or come in contact with every single day. So today's day one I am about to get down on this lemonade. This one has Granny Smith apples, aloe water, lemon, a hint of agave, which I don't usually um, ingest, but it's in this one, and then mint. And all of it's organic, if you can see. Oop. Yeah. Lemonade. All of it's organic, and the Granny Smith apple is good for energy. It still has fiber in there. The aloe is amazing for helping to heal your digestive system. The mint is also cooling to the body, and the lemon, as most of us know, is very alkalizing. So that's the first juice. I'm doing five juices a day, one in the morning, two in the evening, and two at night, along with a nut milk, which I will show you later today. And I hope you guys like this video. If you have questions, comments, concerns, um, put them in the description box below and I will answer them. 
But now I'm gonna dive into this juice, get to doing to work, and uh, get to doing to work, yeah. <laughs> get going to do work. And don't forget to like and subscribe. There's a button, a little watermark on one of these corners. I can never remember which one it is because it's like opposite from where I put my hands. Um, so make sure you hit that subscribe button, hit the little bell below, and that will alert you every time I come out with a new video in this series or a new video in my Rock My Goals Now video series that I am doing with the beautiful and wonderful Soul Ballard. If you guys, like I said, have any questions, comments, concerns, put it down below and I will get to you. Have a great day, guys.